Hey everybody. Well, I'm out walking my dog. Um, two weeks after I've dropped my truck off at the dealership. I mentioned to some of you guys that have watched that uh, it uh, was planned to drop the vehicle off for the truck <clears throat> off for two weeks for them to fix, uh, you know, the little things that are happening. Um, the back window vibration, the vibration from the front in between the cab and the engine, um, the uh, kind of unbalancing of the tires, it seems to be the problem. And the biggest kind of pet peeve and, and issue, you know, don't get wrong, it, the truck works, but uh, it's the, the whole electronics connectivity and, and features that the truck, you know, has that just don't seem to work. And so um, they were basically going to replace the APEM is what the plan was. Um, the module there to so that it could, you know, go back to reset and factory and all that fun jazz and have it updated because that's probably what the issue is. And, uh, the dealerships had it for two weeks and they say that, uh, they spent, you know, 15, 20 hours trying to update and service and whatever else they need to do, uh, to get it work, working properly. And it's not. The other part of it is it's not actually, um, showing any faults or codes that they could just easily um, replace it with. So uh, Ford and their geniuses have said that they're not going to replace it because there is a major February update uh, coming for all over-the-air updates. Well, mine's not updating. Um, so that's, <laughs> I don't, it's going to be an issue. I don't know. Uh, so not very happy about it. And... Uh, um, it's like I said, been two weeks and they haven't fixed it. The only thing they have fixed is the back window, they say, uh, cause they replaced the whole thing. Um, so we'll see if that's the case. Outside of that, nothing's been resolved and it's been there for two weeks. So yeah, not happy about it. But, uh, what I, I thought I would do is add a, a little montage of the things that I'm having problems with, um, for everybody out there to, you know, see if you have the same problems as you do. Go to your dealership, go to Ford, complain. The more of us that are complaining, hopefully the more they'll do something about it. Um, you can see me frosting up right now because I'm outside in minus 33 weather uh, with my dog. <laughs> Who usually sits with me in the mornings to check out my vehicle. But uh, it is minus 33, so we're not out very long. Uh, just got to do his biz. Anyways, here's my montage. Talk to you soon. Nothing. There it is. 11 kilometers away and it, it it alerts me. And it will continuously alert me for no reason. So I've turned the heat on high and I've even turned the fan on auto high. And do you hear the fan? Not much. Here it is. Still here, idling, 0.8, engine in. I don't know, man. Just random, so you know, the truck is in reverse, and there's no backup sound. I actually love it, but it's odd, just to let you know. Yep. Well, there's my montage. Hopefully, uh, you see the little things that are, and hear the little things that are happening. Um, they're funny, they're quirky. Again, not life-threatening for the most part. Uh, and so, you know, hoping to get my truck, I'm just, I'm just gonna get my truck back uh, until they can actually get a solution or a fix for it, because just sitting there for two weeks is, is really not doing me any justice. So, that's the plan. Like always, guys. Thanks for following. Hope it was a, a fun video for you. Till next time.